Hello. Well, uh, I did a video here about uh, three weeks ago, maybe less, four weeks ago, maybe less, maybe more. But I figured that uh, I would uh, go ahead and update on uh, the flooding from that last video. And so uh, let's take. We've had some trees fall over here. I'm here at the Waterloo Park. A couple of trees falling over there. And uh, the water's gone up maybe another foot or two. So let's check it out. Uh, I'm already in the park, so now I'm on, my, on the exit. But uh, I figure that uh, just on the spare of the moment, I drove down here, and uh, I can see back over here. Uh, you can see some more trees that have fallen. As a matter of fact, as I was coming in, I see one tree really on a steep lean, about ready to fall over the, the entrance, exit to the park, and we're coming up on that. Uh, so, it looks like another tree's falling over there. We had some really bad winds and power went out about 5.30 this morning. Lucky I got the coffee bean. Here's the tree that's in question. You can see it leaning right over. And it's about ready to fall. And I'll bet you this will fall fairly soon. It's already pulling the ground up. Okay, and then uh, we're starting to get a little flooding in the park. I think on the last video I did, this there was no water here at all. The water was still high coming down the river, but not really bad. It's supposed to rain today and rain a little bit tomorrow. And then we're going to have a day or two of clear weather. The, the problem we're having is uh, we had a lot of snow in the mountains. And uh, the temperature rose. And it rose to, uh, went from freezing up into the 40, 50 degrees. And now we're getting this melt off. You can see it, it's quite obvious. And they got this blocked off. Normally you can stand on this, but yeah, that's, that's going good. A lot of the rocks that I showed in my earlier video were showing up, but uh, looks like they're under under the water. And that's pretty high. Uh, some of the areas here don't show it, but it's it's about only a foot from cresting over the uh, embankment. shots of this down here. Whoa, I don't want to hit that tree, damn it. <laughs> Snuck up on me. Yeah, so it's 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 going. I shot some film here about two or three years ago when it, when the park was closed, but I never never put it online. I didn't have a smartphone. I had a ghetto phone. I'm sure everybody's had those at one time. Yeah, none of those rocks are showing. Those are some pretty steep rapids down there. That water's going to town. Maybe I can get up over the bridge without a bunch of cars. 
is getting behind me. And, uh, but as I said, the park isn't closed, so that's nice. I'll come over here to my uh, left. I guess evidently they're going to be building something here, either some homes or who knows. I have no idea. They cut the trees down and that's what they've done. So we're going to go up over the bridge here and see what we can see. I'll try to hold this camera. Hope the sheriff doesn't go by and ticket me. <laughs> You're not supposed to be doing this, huh? Anyway, there it is. That is it. Normally there's all kinds of rocks and stuff. You can stand out there, but not now. Yeah, so I'm gonna turn around here. there but this is pretty unusual for this time of the year usually we get some problems in February and March so anyway that's it for now and uh, see a lot of branches have blown off some of these trees <laughs> <laughs> 